Hi friends, welcome to a new video on budget trip to Bandipur Wildlife Sanctuary. Friends, Bandipur Wildlife Sanctuary is in Karnataka state. What you are seeing on the screen now is their forest office with the training college where the forest officials are getting trained over here. This Bandipur area is almost 16 to 18 kilometers from Mudumalai forest. This Bandipur you can reach either from Tamil Nadu that is Uti, Gudlu and Bandipur or from Mysore. The Bandipur for this Bandipur for this Bandipur Wildlife Sanctuary you have to book your ticket through online only. The link for which I will provide in my description. Actually the reservation counter or the entrance area is just 7 kilometers away from this center, this forest office. From this forest office to Towards Mysore Road, you have to travel another 7 kilometers for this reservation counter come entrance area where you have to get in or get your pass for the wildlife trip. See, see this uh, from Mudumalai to this Bandipur area on both the side of this road. Actually, it will be a very nice, lush green and very beautiful. September, October, November and all, it will be very nice. And uh, being this is uh, taken during the month of February, it is full dry area. On this roadside you can see, both the sides you can see more elephants and gaur, the Indian gaur or Nilgiri gaur. And also you can see more number of spotted deers as well as monkeys, the langur and all also you can see on the roadside itself. This is the very popular destination for these animals throughout the year. There are two types of forest safaris are here. That is through forest that is jungle lodges also you can go or directly book online through forest department. If you book through jungle lodges, it is jointly maintained by forest department as well as by this jungle lodge group. Wherein you have to book your stay, then only they will take you for the forest safari on a, their jeep. It is costing around 6,500 rupees, which I have uh, given the detail in my earlier video, which I, I will provide the link below. Now what I am going to show you is through direct forest department trip and a cheap and best lodging or staying accommodation with food and all. See what is the difference between this jungle lodge trip and this direct forest department trip is a, a small difference is there. If you go through the jungle lodges, wildlife sanctuary, stay and accommodation food all includes with a jeep trip. The jeep will take you through the forest for 3 hours safari. Whereas here what I am showing you is a direct forest department jungle safari. This is 2 hour jeep safari or 1 and a half hour bus safari. Since more people are coming over here, to accommodate more people, they have reduced the jeep safari timings and bus timings. Actually, morning 6 o'clock on bus safari and 7.30 or 8 o'clock on safari they are having. So this is the outskirts of this Bandipur forest safari area. Once you reach this area, on the left side, you can find more number of 
lodges left and right side you can see more number of stay that is resorts and uh, restaurants you can see straight on towards the mysore road where you can see these uh, lodges and restaurants see on the left side you see there is a tea shop after that you can see moon mirror lodge and resort that is the one i am showing you right now see the white car is going inside the barrel i am also going on that way only so if you go inside of this moon mirror resort a beautiful and spacious located lodge and resort is here what you are seeing in front of the camera this is what the lodge and resort you can park and go inside or behind this restaurant there is a lodging area or the resort area is there where twin bedroom resorts are there so this is my bedroom or this is my area for working i have booked this room for 1500 rupees only this is a double bedroom come on let's go inside so this is a double bedroom for two people 1500 rupees is a very cheap comparing to the other which i told about 6500 rupees this is a 1500 rupees for two people with the attached bathroom i'll show you the restroom it is a very spacious restroom with western type and hot water facilities also available very nicely maintained with the decent facilities some chairs provided tea pot is provided and all things are provided so after booking this if you go just 1 km away from this restaurant or this resort if you travel 1 km towards mysore road on left and right side you can see more number of resorts depending upon your cost and your budget you can book it what i have shown is a very decent and very minimal amount of rent and charges so i told you that 1500 rupees for the room rent alone and food what you are ordering you can pay accordingly whereas in other lodges it is fixed rate they will charge for boarding and lodging and which is on the higher side here depending upon your order you can pay so if you travel 1 km away from this resort on the left side you can find this this government booking area this is what the entrance you can see so here the is the booking office even if you have booked online you have to come and claim your uh, seat here only for this direct booking so since i have booked for the evening safari i have reached here uh, sorry i have not booked for my safari i want to get a direct ticket over here so i came here so now for uh, the 3 o'clock safari 2 o'clock they will open the office normally 2 to 2:30 they will open the office wherein the first first preference will be given for the online booking peoples once the online allotment is over with the seat numbers then they will give ticket for the direct booking for bus it is 650 rupees plus camera charges extra you have to pay whatever the size of the lens you are having you have to pay extra amount for that and here also they are providing jeep safari which is only for 2 hours for jeep safari jeep see it is 4999 rupees for 
five persons. If you have five peoples, you can take a jeep with the four thousand nine hundred ninety nine plus. The entrance fees and lens are just extra. Since I have gone alone, I have to fight to find a people who can accommodate with me in the jeep. So I was talking with some peoples to join with me to take for a jeep. So I got friend who has come from Bombay with his family. They are having three peoples and myself on four. So four people joined together. We took this jeep safari. Actually, it's very difficult to get because normally they won't allot it so easily. And uh, getting a partners for this jeep safari on the direct trip is also of somewhat difficult. because we have to talk to the people so we have to convince the people and get the safari it is somewhat difficult if they are already interested means it's very easy if interested people so not there means then we have to go for bus safari only i have already explained to you in my previous video that what is the difference between jeep safari and bus safari a little sort of privacy will be there for jeep safari the place where you can stop and how long you can stop in a place and take photography but whereas in bus it's crowded with 18 or 20 people and it's little difficult for the photographers to take a photography that is the difference so for this trip room rent 1500 rupees for two people and i told you jeep safari it is 5000 for five people 4000 499 for five people so you can calculate for a single person how much if you two people are sharing it is 2500 rupees if since we are four people are sharing it is 1300 rupees so we have taken the jeep starting our trip nice family for friends who have come from bombay when i talk to them they are also related to my department where i am working so it was a fantastic opportunity to meet such people and i had a very good time with them on my jeep safari so friends please take a note of note of it so room rent 1500 rupees and jeep safari 4,500 and 4,990 rupees for people traveling on the jeep sea and depending upon the number of counts you have to divide it the expenses such a cheap way you can take your safari trip in Bandipur hope it was a useful information for you to have a budget safari in Bandipur if you plan plan accordingly whether you to book online or to come directly and get the people involved and discuss with them and have a sharing accom- accommodation as well as for the sharing trip for the jeep safari depends upon you i have provided the information needed for you always it's better to have a jeep safari if you prefer a little bit of privacy that is the place where you can stop and how long you can watch for a tiger or leopard it depends upon your convenience thank you friends if you like and and if you feel this is a good information for you please like this video and share this video to your friends and please don't forget to subscribe my channel thank you friends now what you are seeing is after our safari we are returning to our resort we had a nice time we have seen the tiger we have seen the gorr we have seen elephant after that we are returning to our resort see once we return to our resort on the road side in front of the resort you can see a tea shop wherein you can have your tea 
and you can refresh yourself once after getting refreshed you can enter into your resort or in resort also they are supplying room services also there whatever the things you are ordering for it you will get it there in your room itself since we are going to i am going to stay here tonight and and also i am planning for tomorrow morning safari i am after my refreshment i am returning to my room thank you friends and in my next video i'll provide details about the road trip to dimbam road how it looks it's a dangerous road that also i'm providing a video and also mudumalai from uti to mudumalai via kallatti road which is a dangerous road and which there you will not get a permission to go by only drivers belonging to uti can drive through that road that also i'll provide in another video bye